All right, we are going to go to breaking news right now. Detroit police are investigating a shooting that took place after the tree lighting. And 7 Action News reporter Brett Cass joining us now live with the very latest. Brett, what do we know? Well, really unfortunate news to report here downtown. We're just outside of Campus Marshes where that tree lighting was. We just heard from Chief James White a few moments ago. There have been two shootings here downtown involving teenagers. We know right here at the corner, uh, right by the Lafayette and American Coney Island, there was a 15 year old who was shot in the neck. He's taken to a local hospital where he remains right now, but they believe there was two groups of teenagers that exchanged gunfire. There may have been shots fired. Uh, we're still working to get the exact details, but we know there's another shooting that happened near where the Buffalo Wild Wings is. Uh, I think that re recently closed, but it's just a block or so away from Campus Martius. Also another possibly teenager shot there as well. A and again, Chief James White says both of those seem to be related. Uh, two different groups seem to be in some sort of altercation, some sort of fight. We don't know if they were at the tree lighting, but it happened near here, literally just feet, a uh, few hundred feet away uh, from where that scene was earlier today. Uh, we know police are right now are trying to gather some video to get surveillance photos of this suspect out. We know he's still on the loose right now. We don't know if that suspect is responsible for both shootings. We just know from the chief that those two shootings are related. Again, here in Detroit, they actually have a curfew for uh, teens 17 and under, and uh, they're currently patrolling the area to see if there's still a lot of teenagers here out with a parental guardian. So teens under that age have to be with a parent or guardian who's 21 or older, and those teens aren't or who aren't will be taken to police, I believe, police headquarters or another precinct, and uh, they'll try to alert a parent, and parents could be ticketed for those violations. So again, they're still working to get information on who this shooter might be to get some surveillance photos out there. But again, two teenagers shot here in downtown Detroit. Amira. Really sad to hear this on a night uh, where we had so much cheer celebrating the, the tree lighting. Brett Cass, thank you for the latest information. We'll check in with you in a little bit.